When you go to the program, they put you through ringers. They don't make you, but they encourage you. And as they said, there are other people around that are, have the same problems, and you become friends with them. You encourage them. They encourage you. I thank God for that program and others that are all around us to help us with whatever it is we're going through. There are programs to help you if you have diabetes, if you have high blood pressure, whatever it is, there's something out there that can help. And I thank God that there's a way to be helped. We don't have to sit at home on oxygen 24 seven, can't leave the house because it's not possible to take the oxygen with us. Nowadays it is. And once you get out there, you get around, your family enjoys you, they're not so worried because they see that you're able to do some things that you weren't able to do before. And it is what God would want. Not too many people come to your house for you to witness to, for you to minister to, for you to encourage. But when you're out, you're able to encourage others just by being there sometimes. And I know I'm encouraged and blessed the more I see people that have a condition, as the doctor says, and they still are living their life to the best of their abilities. It's not easy having a baby and taking a baby around all the time with all the things they need. That's not easy. But the joy is being able to see that child enjoy what's around. It's the same with your family. When you are doing all you can do to enjoy them, they enjoy you. So no matter what you think, stop being stubborn, enjoy life, and do what you have to do to live the best that you can to God's glory. Thank you again for listening to my precious moments and know that life is good. You said life is good? Yes. Life. Say it for me. Come on. Life is good. Oh, I love it when she says that, everybody. Well, you know, it's about that time. And as always, we end the show, every show, the same way as we do every show. And today is no exception. So, we want you to receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior if you do not know him. And if you have stepped away out of the fold of Jesus Christ and you need restoration back to Christ, you can repeat this prayer after me also. So, here we go. Lord Jesus, come into my heart and be my Lord and personal Savior. I admit that I'm a sinner. I repent now from all that I have done and ask you to forgive me. Come into my heart. I love you. Thank you very much for being my Lord of Lord and Kings of Kings. And I receive you as Lord and Savior in every aspect of my life. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Well, it's that simple. It's not hard to receive Jesus. Jesus is so simple to come to. It's so easy to come to Jesus. And we thank you so much for allowing us into your homes. Now that you've received Jesus Christ as your Lord and personal Savior, call us, let us know, or write us and let us know. And get into a word church. There are plenty of wonderful churches, plenty of men and women of God in the body of Christ. So make sure you find a good one. And we thank you again for allowing us into your home. Amen. And you have a very blessed day. Goodbye. Enjoy delightful, authentic Mexican dishes and a fine Christian atmosphere at La Paz Family Mexican Restaurant, 335 North Spence Avenue at Cobblestone Place, Goldsboro. Choose from a delicious selection of tacos, enchiladas, burritos, and more. Come in during Taco Tuesday, and all tacos are 99 cents. On Saturdays, come in and try our half-price lunch menu from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. La Paz is closed on Sunday for worship, but open Monday through Saturday, 11 to 9. La Paz Family Mexican Restaurant, 335 North Spence Avenue. Come see us.